Hello children, in this video, you will learn about the different types of computers. Computers are basically differentiated into three types based on their operating principles, analog, digital and hybrid. Digital computers are further classified as micro, mini, mainframe and supercomputers. Now let's learn about analog computers. Analog computers are used to process analog data. Analog data is of continuous nature, which is not discrete or separate. Such type of data includes temperature, pressure, speed, weight, voltage, depth, etc. These quantities are continuous and having an infinite variety of values. It measures continuous images in some physical quantity such as the speedometer of a car measures speed. The change of temperature is measured by a thermometer. The weight is measured by a weighing machine. These computers are ideal in situations where data can be accepted directly from measuring instrument without having to convert it into numbers or codes. Analog computers do not require any storage capability because they measure and compare quantities in a single operation. Output from an analog computer is generally in the form of readings on a series of dial such as speedometer of a car or a graph on strip chart. Digital computers a digital computer works with digits to represent numerals, letters or other special symbols. Digital computers operate on inputs which are on-off type and its output is also in the form of on-off signal. Normally, an on is represented by a 1 and an off is represented by a 0. So we can say that digital computers process information which is based on the presence or the absence of an electrical charge. A digital computer can be used to process the numeric as well as non-numeric data. It can perform arithmetic operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication and division and also logical operations. Most of the computers available today are digital computers and the most common example of digital computer is a calculator. The results of digital computers are more accurate than the results of analog computers. Digital computers can store information. We can say that digital computers count and analog computers measure. Digital computers are classified into four types. Microcomputers which are commonly known as personal computers or PC. Mini computers are more powerful than microcomputers. Mainframe computers have many processors and can support more than 100 users at a time. Supercomputers are the most powerful among digital computers. Param and Anurag are the supercomputers developed by India. Hybrid computers. A hybrid computer is a combination of digital and analog computers. It combines the best features of both types of computers, that is, it has the speed of analog computer and the memory and accuracy of digital computer. They can take continuous signals as input and they can also process those signals digitally. Hybrid computers are used mainly in specialized applications where both kinds of data need to be processed. Therefore, they help the user to process both continuous and discrete data. For example, a petrol pump contains a processor that converts fuel flow measurements into quantity and price values. In hospital intensive care unit, an analog device is used which measures patient's blood pressure which are then converted and displayed in the form of digits. Hybrid computers for example, are used for scientific calculations in defense and radar systems. PlayStation 3D movie or computers used in weather forecasting 
our hybrid computers. I hope children you have understood about the different types of computers very well. Thank you children.